Hello and welcome back to Northern Adventures. My name is Veggie Chops and um, let's do this. I can't remember what we did last time. It's been a couple of days. Um, so I started, um, uh, so just to let you guys know, I was uploading for, I mean, it was, it's been like a month almost. I've been up uploading one episode a day. Uh, and uh, it's been it's been really really fun doing that, but um, I'm I'm at the point where I uh, it's it's getting really hard to upload regularly on that, so I don't, I don't think it's unreasonable to uh, pull back on that. So that's what I'm doing a little bit. I could use a drink. Are you pulling back on that? So I'm still gonna be releasing stuff, obviously. And if you have any comments, you can always leave it and you know let your voice heard. If you have any uh, opinions on what's going on. Um, okay. So, um, just a side note as well. Uh, I <laughs> I just played, I uh, you know, I was doing like casually this interloper run. Um, oh, look how freaking gorgeous that is. Oh my god. So beautiful. So beautiful. Um... Like I, made it I was just doing an intro run. I just died <laughs> this morning. Uh, this morning or this afternoon or whatever the hell it was after I did my class. Uh, and it was a lot of fun. Um, so I'm going to have to get... But I'm going to have to figure out what we were doing on this one. I don't know if we wrote down what we were doing. Clean up office. Okay, I imagine we did that since we're not at the office anymore. Hit every region on the map. Okay, so we got. Um, we are Forlorn Muskeg. So we've been to Desolation Point, Crumbling Highway, Coastal Highway, Winding River, Pleasant Valley, Timberwolf Mountain, A A Ash Canyon, um, Mr. Lake, Forlorn Muskeg, Mountain Town. So we're missing Hush River Valley and, Bro and Broken Railroad. A uh, broken railroad is kind of like uh, it's like a suicide mission uh, because there's just like so many wolves in there. But it's a nice place to loot. There's a nice um, garage. It's a nice place to loot. I have to find a way back to Hush River Valley, and I think it's through here to get to Mountain Town, then to go to Hush River Valley. Um, so let's just quickly. Uh, it's early morning. Uh, we could we could actually do with a little bit more sleep actually here. Let's sleep another two hours. Uh, we'll after this we'll just check our food situation. I can't remember for the life of me what our <coughs> what our situation is. Okay, we're at sixty one days. Let's see our food situation. Okay, we got a lot of cattail. We we got some we got some dog food, etc. Got lots of coffee. We've got some soup. Um, okay. Uh, we don't need these crafting materials, I don't think. All our things are in pretty good shape. The, the pot's in a little bit of a beat up shape, but that's. I think that's fine. Mm, this is a little bit beat up, but it's fine. Our gun. Okay. So, yeah, things are not. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good. Uh, did we want to craft? Oh, we don't have. We don't have uh, the stuff to craft. Oh, these are not even. Oh, these are these are these are not even uh, cured. Okay, never mind. Not never mind. I didn't say anything. Okay. Okay. So I think we could make our way out of the region. Let's go to, we could go to Broken Railroad or we can go to Hush River Valley through Mountain Town. I think we have enough resources on us to not really worry about <clears throat> any of that stuff. Uh, you know, uh, there's no way we're going to like freeze to death or anything, especially with the resources we have on us. We have our gun. Um, so yeah, we can, we can make a decision. Um, 
Yeah, let's just uh, let's just go to uh, let's just go to uh, Broken Railroad. I think we were supposed to do something else, but I can't really remember what we were supposed to do. Sorry about that. I apologize. It's been a couple of days. It's been a couple of days in between. It's also going to be weird playing this difficulty when I was just playing Interloper. I got Interloper is so hard. It is so fun though. Like it, it, it's so rewarding when you last it and you live a day. <laughs> it's so rewarding when you live a day. It's so rewarding when you find like one piece of loot because the loot table, like the loot is so few and far between, like apart. Like you don't get a lot of loot. Like it's very, very, very limited amount of uh, stuff. So uh, it's, <laughs> you just like really appreciate every little jacket you get or every little thing you get. So I think I was I got to like day 19 or something like that um, and on day 19 I had <clears throat> I had um, like only like 10 degrees of warmth I think something like that. I guess in this run we haven't been uh, doing this. We've been shooting our way out of everything, right? So I guess I'll have to adapt myself to that because in the interloper one, <coughs> oh, with the bear skin, they're scared now a lot of the times. That's interesting. So yes. They have a chance of being um, <clears throat> scared away by the bear skin roll. So in the uh, interloper run I just did, I got, I died to a wolf that went through a torch. I put a torch down and the, the, the wolf went through it and attacked me. <laughs> <clears throat> it was so funny because I was like on the way, I was like, I was so sure I was doing well. Like I said, day 19 or something like that I think it was. It was really fun. Um, I, I spawned in Forlorn Muskeg right here, actually, which is kind of funny. Um, I w made, w made way my way to Mystery Lake. Um, come on, dude. That hit him. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to kill this wolf eventually. Because he keeps on getting in front of us. So yeah, we went to Mystery Lake after after spawning here, uh, which was fun, yeah. and. Um, With our Tam. All right, let's make our way. Uh, basically, it's the exits right over here. 
right underneath us here, right where the train tracks go through the uh, the mountain here. Uh, I can't remember the area at all, except for one place, so bear with me. I don't really remember it. <clears throat> yeah, see the train tracks go over here. See if we can we could uh Billy go our way down this. Okay, here we are. Make sure I'm recording. Yeah, a little bit late to make sure I was recording, but you know, you know how I roll. There's a wolf right over there. Okay. And uh, what else has happened to me? I uh, I I got that. Um, so I started. I I sent to motion uh, some things for uh, the job. Um. So some there's I I I kind of applied to this third party company that kind of sets up contracts, one day contracts with uh, different uh, places so I can go and try out different places. Uh, I know that's not super specific, but it is what it is. Um, and it's one step closer to me uh, trying to get something up north, like I was saying. So yeah, I'm putting, putting things into motion. Not sure how things are gonna pan out, but you know, that's life. That's the beauty of life, you know. You never know. Oh my god, I... This is Broken Railroad? Oh my gosh, I've... It's been so long I haven't been here. Holy smokes, I forgot about this area. I remember when I first started this game. I got lost here because... There was a storm hit that hit... I think there's like a place to loot it back here and you actually have to go over like a secret thing to get into the other area I think if I remember correctly I probably don't remember correctly but uh, let's just see yeah I was lost here I was I was going around trying to find a way out of the region or not out of the region but like to continue on you know what I'm saying and, uh, how much weight do we have on us? Okay, we're, uh, we're up against the ropes there. I should have dropped some stuff at... Hmm. Two wolves. Holy fuck, I'm getting good with this thing. There's no loot here. I was mistaken. We're gonna be shooting a lot of wolves up here when we go, so just, be, just get ready. That's bullshit, bro. Yeah, I get the higher ground. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Our first encounter. I mean, you know. It is what it is. I hope they didn't. I hope the uh, wolf didn't get a lot of our... 97... I can't even remember what this stuff was at, but this looks all really good, so. Motherfucker.
Right, here it is. So you go along here and then you're like, wait a second, what's going on here? Why is there a block? Why is it blocked off? And there's a way around landslide. All right, so higher ground is not good in this game. There you go, that's good to know. Let's go down here. Oh no, I don't remember at all. I don't remember at all what we're supposed to do. Cattail here, maybe we should take some cattail and eat. Oh, there's a bridge. There's a little bridge over here. Mm. See this wet dog food. Welcome to Broken Railroad. <laughs> oh my god. Can't believe it. Two steps in and we already got our asses kicked by a wolf. One thing I gotta say though is that there's um, the idea that Interloper has fewer wolves is definitely true. Stalker has so many wolves and it. it's cr incredible. It's unreal actually. Okay, so um, is there a pathway somewhere? I, I cannot remember this area. Okay, there's a pathway. Cannot remember this map. It is just around just past noon. I, like I said, I don't think this correlates with actual the actual clock, but if it does, then it's noon. How have you guys been doing? I hope you're enjoying your day. You're coming to chill out. Okay, here the line continues. I see. There we go. Okay. And what's over here? Oh yes, this is the way. Oh, we already hear the wolves yapping. I hope we pick up some ammunition. Because we're going to be shooting our way into this and out of this. It's going to be like a war zone. Speaking of war zone, I actually can't believe what's happening in... Um... Look at how many wolves there are. That's a transition area, right? That's what that means? But where would that transition to? There's nothing there. I thought this meant this is a transition area. That's what the... Uh, I think Gunner told me that. Someone told me that. Uh, I think it's worth exploring. I just don't want to get jumped by a wolf as it goes over the mountain. That's the problem.
This is not at all. Okay, so I'm not going to trust that thing anymore. This thing. Doesn't seem to be what I thought it was. Yeah, the like the interloper thing, it was crazy. It was like I was pretty proud of myself to last that long. I hadn't lasted that long since last year. Like last year I think I got to like I don't know, twenty something days. And here it was pretty close to that. It was like I don't know. Hold on, I think I could check actually. Options. No, I can't check. I have to get out of the game to check. No wait. Um Do I have a journal? I can't check the journal. Okay. Hey, you'll have to believe me. Or you can believe what you want to believe, but that's pretty much the truth. But I think it gets really hard here. I think there's going to be like tons of <laughs> wolves surveying the, the area. Well, we've already seen so many. What's down there? Oh, there's a trolley down there. Okay, cool. This will come in handy. Take it with us, but I'm not too excited to. All right, ready? already oh shit that scared me I really gotta watch out when there's uneven terrain. That's really dangerous. We almost lost it there. Uh, let's run. There we go. I don't want to bleed out. I mean, uh, the chances of dying are. It's possible for us to die on another attack there. I don't want to take a chance though. Well, this stuff will come in handy. Oh. I guess crowbars uh, don't really. Arrow shaft, interesting. Okay. Oh, there's another forge here, right? Yeah, I forgot about that. I think there's things in here, but I don't want to take the time to break them down and make it then try because like maybe there aren't things in there. All right, let's make the rounds. All right, we're 
25 minutes in. Simple parka. Uh, I think we're pretty good, right? Yeah, we got like expedition parkas. No, no, that, we don't need any of that pedestrian stuff. I wonder if the owner's around. Oh, dang. Very nice. Oh yeah. All these goodies. And they're all ski boots. I didn't even know those existed. Wait. These are better than these. There are four kgs though. Holy God. They're better temperature wise, but they're way too heavy. They give more protection too. And more wind resistance. But just the four kgs, I think it's too much of a Man, they're probably amazing. Okay, well we could think about it. I think I can use this. Because what we can do is we can fix it up real nice. And um another book, nice. We are reading books, right, in this in this playthrough. I, if I haven't totally messed that up. I can't believe we're so lucky that we didn't get hit by that wolf. That we're so lucky, because we could have died there. That could have been a real death. I actually changed the, the field of view yes, um, today when I was playing a little bit to see if it would be better to to record with a wider field of view. The only problem is that the motion is a little bit too much, I think, but I'm not sure. Um, we could try it out on another recording and see how it looks like, but it felt like it was a little bit too much. Revolver ammunition. I'll take we don't it. need revolver ammunition. We need rifle ammunition. I also notice that I have a tendency to look down when I walk. That's how I do it when I walk in real life. So this will come in handy. I mean, what's the world? Oh, what does the world come to when we're just throwing a Mackinac thing out? Okay, well, I didn't realize we had two of these. Okay, so everything's pretty perfect. Like, I don't know what we're even looking for equipment wise. There can't be much that we can use equipment wise. Uh, two point. Yeah, let's just take it. pack well let's just eat that right now or right, let's there we go we're all full and here's the forge we wanted to craft something. I don't know what we, could, what we could possibly craft. I don't think we need anything. Oh. 
Yeah, I would guess that the munitions workbench is somewhere in here, but I have no idea. I've never used it, and I don't know if anyone... I haven't seen anyone ever use it, so I don't know. Uh, coal, we have three. We don't need more than that. Much more, at least. We'll drop the scrap metal somewhere just to keep it here. If we want to come back. I doubt we're going to want to come back here. We got so much scrap metal. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Well, we can stay here for the night. And if that's the case, we can fix up some things before the sun goes down. With the metal pieces is what I'm trying to say. Well, this stuff will come in handy. You're just a pack rat, aren't you, Astrid? 80%, I think that's better than the one we have, right? Yeah. More cloth. Fill up our uh, lantern. We'll drop that after. Imagine finding something in a garage and a garbage can. Like. <laughs> All right. I think we searched everything. Uh, there is a room we didn't go into, right? Oh, we didn't search this. Cured leather, nice. We went into this room? Did we go into this room? There's another room we didn't go into, I know it. Over here, did we go into this room? Yeah, we did. There's another room then. There's for sure another room I'm missing. Where is it? Could have sworn that there was another room. There's definitely another place. It's like an open up area. I, I remember it. I'm very certain. Lots of exits. There's, an, there's a door to an open area. Maybe it's on the side? I don't know. I'm very confused. I am getting to this place mixed up with another place, maybe? Oh, here we are. Okay, I knew there was another place. I think I can use this. Actually, we might, we might need that before the night's over. They hate the light. Who's they? Wait, I said I wouldn't check the garbage cans, right? Oh my god, in those interloper, uh, the interloper runs, you're so desperate for loot, you check everything. You can't take a chance that there's something mm. you haven't okay. checked, you know. You just can't afford to because there's so very, there's so little. I'll 
take it. Okay. Let's do some uh, fixing up some stuff uh, that we know we're gonna use. So this we could fix up. This we could fix up. Let's do the uh, feel that. We could drop that. We can drop that. We can fix these up and see. Mm -mm -mm. We don't need these anymore. I don't know if we need these, so I'm going to drop them. Already this low. Okay, we're gonna have to clean up some stuff for sure. Um, so we could fix these up and see how they are. I just feel like they're so freaking heavy, but they are. I mean, think about it. It's gonna be like almost three degrees. Is it worth it? if it's worth it I don't think it's worth it I want to travel late okay let's uh let's fix up it's this first first our cleaning is getting really good I think so we probably want to do like three oh there you go a hundred percent um, this 86. Five percent improvement. Okay, 91. Uh, this needs to be sharpened. Five percent improvement. Eighty three percent. More sharpen. Okay. That's good. We need to fix this up. Let's see. Let's pick up some. Let's pick up some metal and let's fix this. Repair. Oh, we don't have simple tools. Okay. Well, that, 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 fi that fixes that problem. Um,. This needs to be repaired. It's an hour and 20 minutes. Probably have enough time for that. Yeah, enough time for that. Perfect. Uh, what are we at? 20 degrees. Probably need to repair this and this. Twenty seven minutes, perfect. It's good. Twenty eight degrees still, hmm. Um anyway, things are close enough to perfect. Like these two need to be repaired a little bit, but not really. Uh let's drop things that we don't need. Well, actually. This is a very small region and it's not, there's not a lot like there's, this is basically what's here. I've been around and uh, around the edges. There is this like little cabin. I think I kind of feel like there is a little cabin somewhere. I don't know if it's worth it to go. Uh, we could go, you know what? We're here. We might as well check it out. I can't remember 
really. So, um, okay, let's go from the bottom up. Okay, we have enough bandage. We need some more cloth before we leave, so we could probably break stuff down if they have anything here. Um, these books, gonna read these books eventually. Whetstone. I mean, we could drop some coal. Um, and we're gonna eat some stuffs. Is there anything we could tear apart? That we could break down. some cloth on us uh, we still have to be a little bit more tired because I wanna I still want I wanna I wanna sleep for 10 hours I want to eat the food that's uh oh, we're not even that hungry are we okay never mind let's uh let's drink up let's eat something what can we eat? I guess this MRE, we can eat the rest of it. And we can eat uh, this can the crunchy bar before it's too late. And let's drink this. And there we are. Alright, we're at 43 minutes already in the... God. I guess, all right, I guess it is what it is. Um, yeah, we're gonna, re I think we're gonna recover most of that health there. Uh, maybe we'll make our way up to, we'll make our way up to that cottage. I think it's a cottage there, honestly. I'm gonna, we're gonna try it out. I can't remember, so no guarantees. Wait, are we out of water now? That's not a great amount of water, but and there's a storm out. Love it. All right, we pa we slept away the storm. Nice. I don't know how to get out of here. There's a hole in the wall, so oh, there's a hole there. Somewhere there's a there. There's a, a rope to get. Oh no, the rope's not there. Shit! How do we get up then? We can go around. We can go around. Cause I think up there there's a cabin somewhere. I hope I'm remembering the right place. It's all like kind of a blur to me. Well, it's definitely an adventure. When you don't know what's going on, you have no choice but to be on an adventure. I could have sworn to God that there was a rope up here. How do you get up there if not? I don't want to go back up. You have to go back up. Is this the place? I'm trying to think. Like. 
pretty sure. There's a cool little cabin on the hill. But I think it's this map. we'll find out <clears throat> I'm feeling there's a bear around here too that's what's the scariest thing Okay. Okay, there's a bridge there I never knew or I never saw before, or maybe I just don't remember. That's cool. Okay, let's go around. There's another bridge there. What? Oh. Okay, so I have to go that, that way across and then over around. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense to me. All right, this is cool. We get a little bit of, uh, you know, this is, I love, I love discovering new places. That's really part of the big part of the fun in this game. What is this area? I mean, this is gorgeous, this fog. Exactly how it feels when you're um, when you're up north. It, that's such a that's such a Canadian view right there. Okay, this seems somewhat familiar. Not really. Just have to go around there. could have sworn there was a cabin. I mean, I'm trying to think about... I remember there was a cabin that we haven't touched yet. And I've been to in the game before. And I can't remember where it is. And it has to be here. It has to be here. There's no other place it could be. I think this is where I was taught. I was thinking. Although it's over there, not over here. So I don't know what's over here. I'm pretty sure there's a, ca a cabin over there. This is exciting. This is exciting and interesting. I can't quite remember where it is. I remember... Pretty sure this is it. There it... Is that it? Yes, that's it. Okay. I'm, I, I'm not going crazy. Well, I mean, I am crazy, but... I haven't completely lost my mind. God damn it!
Oh, I'm getting I'm getting bad with this. I'm getting really bad with this. I think I missed like most of my shots tonight. Interesting. All right, so welcome to the hunting lodge. I didn't know that's what it was called, but apparently that's what it's called. Uh, there's tons of uh, wood to break down here. This has been like a pretty man coming here has been crazy. We got attacked, so we got attacked by two wolves or three in this episode alone. Uh, this place is hard because there's so much stuff around, but you have to really like go in between all the things. Everything's hidden. From what I remember at least. Or maybe there's nothing here. I don't know. Oh. Baby. What have we here? Zero percent. Zero percent, guys. If that's not food poisoning, I don't know what is. All right, well, actually, there's nothing around. I thought there'd be more stuff, but there's not. Hmm. This will come in handy. Uh, I don't know if it will. There's this. There's a downstairs. Cute little downstairs. I like this. I like this place. With a little bit of uh, elbow grease, this could be a really beautiful cottage. Nobody <laughs> needs this anymore. How many fire? I've never seen so many fire strikers in one playthrough. Honest to God. Is that how is it even possible? kind of like not starve ourselves but go pretty low on the food thing because I want to use a bunch of the expired food up before bed which is in a billion hours oh, that's so much better I should have had light on the whole time it's less strain on the eyes Even though there's nothing around. Well, we'll use it for the upstairs at least. pants I think we our stuff is too good for that right yeah I like to even consider that well this stuff will come in handy yeah I think I stayed at this place for like a couple of days and I realized how dangerous it was and I just left 
Like, you can't explore much. It's so crippling. Do I have a T? Do I have any T's in here? <sighs> Healed pain. Okay, there you go. Super annoying. Doesn't actually do anything. It's just annoying. Oh, 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 oh. I think I can use this. Five rounds, baby. Six rounds, baby. And there's that mountaineering rope. Urban parka. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yeah, you can once we get out of here. We're going to leave soon. We're going to... I guess we'll stay here for the night and then we'll... We'll leave after that. So much food. Oh, oh. Ah, revolver ammunition. Boo. Okay, I guess that's it. What a freaking fire striker, bro. Oh, what's on the ground there? Is this something? Yep, it's a soda. Hmm. <laughs> All right, cool. Oh. Eight. Oh, and there's a hunting rifle. Looks like this has been here a while. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, with the light, it's better. Like, you see all the little things here. Oh, and there's a six freaking thing stove. Kind of want to take my revenge out on that freaking wolf. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna freaking kill him. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta stay in my territory, honestly. Was doing with cedar firewood in their car, but uh, like this has been here a while. Where'd that motherfucker go? Go. I just want revenge. I want my, I want payback, bro. Did he die? I hear you whimpering like a little bitch. Are you little bitch? There's the uh, garage over there. I'm interested to try out the uh, bridge on the right over there next episode. What's this fucker? There's a bridge over here. There's a bridge there. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, he died. Did he die? Good, you motherfucker. That's who you deserved. Okay, so let's go uh, indoors and time is it? Oh, it's still freaking early, like really early. All right, well I'm gonna say I'm gonna go inside and it'll save. So that'll be the end of that episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, it's interesting coming to a place where I don't know. That's always nice. Uh, I don't know if we have, uh, no, we don't have, uh, I was going to say if we have charcoal, we can, uh, try to map this. I've, I, I remember distinctly that we can't go further than that. So we don't have to go down that way. Oh, oh, I gotta claim my territory. Flat ground though. Let's, uh, let's call it a night because uh, it's been an hour, so we're going to get back. I love this, these chalets. Man, like I said, imagine how sick this chalet would have been in a non-apocalyptic uh, situation, you know? So sick. So, so sick. All right. Well, again, oh, <laughs> finally, I hope you enjoyed the episode. And uh, I guess uh, we'll just make sure it saves. And then, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye.